Hello there everybody, Kevin Davis from Social Traffic Lab again, and I just want to do another video staying on the whole theme of Google Analytics. Uh, Google Analytics is probably one of the most powerful free tools out there that you can use in your business to actually measure what's going on so you know what to improve and what to focus on. So right now I'm actually logged into my Hootsuite account. Um, use Hootsuite to post to Twitter and, and uh, Facebook and as well as uh, uh, LinkedIn and uh, you can actually use it for WordPress sites as well. Um, <coughs> in this case I'm going to post a message to Twitter, to one of my Twitter accounts um, and I'm going to go over and grab a link here for a dollar trial so the 15 day trial, I'm going to grab that link um, and that's what I'm going to use over here in Hootsuite. So I'll start with my copy which is going to say Social Traffic Lab now offering $1 trial for their Facebook apps. And then I'm going to add a link, um, but I'm actually going to click on advanced. So I'm going to click on this gear here, and I get to choose my shortener. I'm going to stay with Owly, which is uh, Twitter's shortler, shortener. But then I have these presets, so I can add custom URL parameters. So like we did with um, with the Google URL tool builder or uh, URL builder, <coughs> we're going to select Google Analytics, and it gives us the parameters automatically. So now I can actually, um, actually what we'll do here first, we'll clear this out. Um, clear this URL out. We'll put in the URL. Then we're going to go advanced and select the preset of Google Analytics. It now adds those parameters on the end like it should. We're going to add a source of Twitter.com. The medium <coughs> is going to be social media. So we're tracking our social media links. And then the campaign is going to be a $1 trial. I mean, we'll just put dollar trial. I'm not sure if it had a problem with the dollar sign, so we'll, we'll do that. And then we'll just apply parameters. So now it's put the parameters in there. Um, it's been saved. I then go over here and I select my Firehorse88 Twitter account. That's checked and we'll also send it out to the Kevin H. Davis one as well. And now we click send now. We could schedule it if we wanted to. Uh, we could add an image or file or a location. We don't need to do that. <coughs> so we just click send now. And you there is a waiting. Oh, we got can't we got to shrink it? So we click shrink. So it's been shrinked and added. So now with all those Google parameters and everything, it's been shrinked down to this. And we click send now. <coughs> and now it just sent that out to my Twitter account. So if I go out to twitter.com slash firehorse88. We now see this new post. If I click this hourly link here, it then goes through and um, up in this very top, it has our tracking information that is going to be captured in Google. So let me see if I can um, bring up a notepad so you can see this a little better. Super big. So here's the extra parameters that I added onto the end of it, even after it did the redirect 
and uh, and now it's tracking that within Google Analytics. So uh, that's a great way to actually track what your social media campaigns are doing. Um, it's really an important uh, aspect of your business to actually know what's performing and what's not. So that's a great way to track it using Hootsuite. And just a disclaimer, I am using the paid version of Hootsuite, so it's like $4.95 $4 a month or something like that in order to have that functionality.